107.5 WBLS, your number one source for R&B. Hey there, what's going on? It's your radio love, Deja Vu, ready to spill some tea for WBLS TV. And you know, it's been a while since we've been together, right? I'm so glad we've had this time together. Okay, now that's something you do at the end. Welcome, how are you? All right, so let's get into some good news right now. Story number three. Three. We got the bling bling going on with, between John Legend and his longtime fiance, model Chrissy Teigen. They tied the knot recently over in Italy. Yay, congrats to them. I'll put the pictures up of her dress and also her new ring. Meanwhile, the king, I'm talking LeBron, King James, actually tied the knot with his longtime girlfriend. They've been dating since high school. They have two boys together and they actually finally said, I do recently in San Diego. So congrats to both couples. Wish you a long and successful marriage. Isn't that what you wish newlyweds? Or do you just wish they just get on with their lives, huh? Well, anyway, congrats to them. We're going to keep telling you about everybody who's getting married. And what about people who are expecting babies? Remember Antoine Dodson? Hide your kids, hide your wife, run tell that. Yeah, well, anyway, he was an outwardly gay male. He found salvation, changed his ways, and now... He impregnated a woman and he has a baby on the way. What? Turned out for what? All right, we'll put the story up so you can check it out. Facebook.com slash WBLS1075 NYC. Story number two, two comes on the heels of Miss America. Did you hear about the pageant? Well, for the second year in a row, a New York lady, Miss New York, has been crowned with the coveted title. But this one marked a first. Miss Nina Duvalari became the first female of Indian American descent to be crowned as Miss America. Now, she's facing all kinds of hate. People are saying, oh, this she's a terrorist and this is America. Why isn't she? Why is she being crowned Miss America? I think it's a great thing. I really do. I think it's about time we're starting to see other cultures represented. She actually did her um, talent and did a traditional dance from her culture. And I just think it's amazing that we're actually starting to open up because people, America is a big melting pot. All right. We have everybody from black, from white to Asian to Indian to wherever we can be represented because we're all one big country. And the sooner we start thinking about that, the sooner things will be moving along, right? All right, in another competition recently, New York City has declared that Bill de Blasio will be the Democratic candidate for mayor as well as Joe Loda for the Republican. So we'll be seeing how that battle shapes out. Make sure you get out there and cast your vote. This is WBLS TV. Story number one is on the way. One. You know, normally we do like the entertainment thing and we laugh and we chuckle and we kiki it up. But right now we have to get a little somber because story number one comes on the heels of a tragedy that struck our nation's capital September 16th. The gunman Aaron Alexis gunned down 12 people, just everyday folks who were working and doing jobs and everything, gunned down because this man with a history of mental illness was allowed to buy a gun and he just ran rampant. He had actual pass and access to the Navy Yard. And this is the thing that I don't understand. Why did he still have access after he'd already been for counseling, hearing voices, thinking that people were after him, having all kinds of paranoia? It just makes us dive deeply into the fact that we need to start, you know, really determining who has access to certain things and going back over what levels of access people have. So as we are, you know, finding out more and more about the gunmen and burying the people who were victims, let's keep them in our prayers because, you know, it could have been you could have been us and it just makes you think every day you got to live your life to the fullest because you never know what could happen to you so just keep them in your prayers and of course we'll keep you updated on any information that we have coming down at wbls.com and also at facebook.com slash wbls 1075 nyc